water. It's nine. I'm actually working. Um, I'm taking a quick little second, little second to get some water. Um, and I want to hop on and say happy Tuesday. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Hi, Jax. I need some overnight oats, which I'm going to eat at my break. Sorry for the lighting. But I'm going to eat on my break um, at 11. So here they are. Um, I just put some milk and I actually put some of my oatmeal creamer because I'm not having coffee so I figured why let it go bad um, and some hi Bubba a tablespoon or half a tablespoon of this light syrup and a little bit of brown sugar it's gonna be like a maple brown sugar concoction yeah I'm gonna put some blues, blueberries in it yeah my overnight oats are literally 10 out of 10 they remind me of the maple brown sugar um, like, like quick oatmeal packs but they're not packed with all of the nasty like chemicals and everything sorry i don't have a spoon my dishes are <laughs> need to be washed but it's so good i'll put the recipe up on the screen it's so easy and i'll probably make it tomorrow um again all right you guys it's lunch time so i'm actually going to be making um a quesadilla i was gonna say quesadilla um, so I have some fat-free cheddar cheese by Kraft, and then I'm going to use a little bit of real cheese just to give it that creamy goodness. And then these are the wraps I'm using, so these are 70 calories each for the other ones, but I don't like them as much as like the Mission brand, so that's that. And then I'm going to add some spicy ranchero sauce to put on the Taco Bell quesadilla. It's not the other one. It's so dang good. I love it. And then I'm going to just put a little bit of lime juice to spice it up. I'm going to dip it in this pico that I got this black bean mild pico sour cream so right now that is i'm looking rough don't judge i'm gonna make that and i'm super 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 excited i just spray the thing with some pam spray which i'm almost all out of okay, so here's my lunch um a cheese quesadilla with that taco bell sauce a little bit of sour cream and a bunch of the salsa so dang good i can't wait i'm starving right, and i'm also gonna fill up my water for my second water of the day i'm gonna try really hard to drink at least three of these um to keep my appetite lower so yeah and then i'm gonna finish this here good afternoon you guys i picked this up yesterday with my friend danielle this is the s'mores good and gather granola it's a limited edition i would highly highly recommend it it has chunks of marshmallow and chocolate so so stinking good and i actually mixed it with just a light and thick greek yogurt vanilla super low in points so 28 grams is only four points and it's quite a bit and i think it'll be really filling with the yogurt we're gonna have chili for dinner and i wanted to show you like a little mini grocery haul so here is a few things that i got so these are my favorite um carb counter shells they're only one point each um otherwise they're 45 calories per shell they're so good they're, they really remind me of just like a basic white tortilla and they're big um i got some chicken thighs because or drumsticks because i'm obsessed with chicken drumsticks and thighs right now i don't know what it is i like can't do chicken breast for some reason it just grosses me out for some odd reason right now and i got this extra crispy shake and bake to try it out on those just i don't know have some something different and then i got these no sugar added popsicles strawberry tangerine raspberry i wanted some popsicles and these were like a healthier option. I got some more Pam spray. I cannot live without this stuff. Like for cooking, it's amazing. I got two avocados. I got a red bell pepper, some baby carrots. Um, for the chili, I got these chopped green chilies, some corn. Um, I also got these potatoes. I thought about putting in the chili to make it kind of like a stew. I don't know if I'm gonna do that though. Um, and then I'm going to try these baked beans in it because my brother and Jason aren't a fan of beans, like kidney beans. And so we thought about trying just these, maybe rinse them off or I don't know, not rinse them off, but drain the juice type thing. Um, and then I got whole tomatoes and Hunt's tomato sauce. My favorite is Hunt's. I love Hunt's. I feel like it tastes super good. And then lastly, I got this diet crayon raspberry juice. Um, because I am not drinking soda right now. So it's water, Gatorade, and then I'm going to try this juice. I don't know. Um, zero points for a serving, five calories. So that's my little grocery haul.
you guys so in this household we aren't huge fans of beans well i don't mind beans um however my brother and jason don't like beans which i might have already said but i can't remember because i'm doing this on instagram and here um however these are actually really good in that in chili um you can drain hold on indy you can drain the juice off the top but i did not um I added tomato sauce and then whole tomatoes. My mom growing up always used whole tomatoes in her chili and it's absolutely phenomenal. And then as far as seasoning, I used pink salt, black pepper, um, chili powder, a little bit of celery salt, some red chili flakes, and cumin. Um, I'm not a huge fan of cumin. Um, I don't know it's it reminds me too much of tacos so and then i put a sweet and low in it which i totally forgot the beans are sweet so i did not need to do that onion powder and a ton of onion powder and a ton of garlic powder and then i also added minced onion as vegetables it's onion celery uh onion celery carrots a red bell pepper and corn To end my night, I'm going to have this sugar-free jello with some ready whip to end my night after I had some chili. It was so, so good. I'd highly recommend trying it with the baked beans. It was absolutely phenomenal. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you in our next one. Bye, guys.